watching Good Morning San Diego. Brad Perry is swapping clothes today. Brad swapping clothes? They better be some big people. That's all I got to say. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, you know what, Dan? This is pretty cool. Uh, you know, where it's we have up. a bunch of clothes in our closets. There's probably uh, dry cleaners that have those clothes that people have not come picked up. And you're looking a place to get rid of them. Why not here in Vista at the Tri-City Church's free clothes swap? And I'll tell you, it was brought up by Diane Record. Come on in here, Diane, because this is so great. Where you started this last year, you had over 200 people come out, and you're doing it for a good cause because you said, you know what, this is something that you saw in the community needed. That's right. There just seems to be a need. You know, we're just trying to make hard times easier. So if you have some clothes that you no longer use, just go ahead and put them in a bag and bring them on down on Saturday. And then we're going to sort them out and put them on tables and then come back on Sunday and then just take what you need for free. Yeah, and this is a great way, especially with school coming back and parents need to have those play clothes. Absolutely. You know what? And this is a great way to find them. Yes, and um, take a look at this stuff. I'm just going to jump right over here. Isn't this cute? Let me just show you this cute little skirt. Look at that. Isn't that cute? We have all kinds of stuff, and we even have clothes that still has the tags on it. Like, here's a pair of brand new Docker pants right here. And we have all kinds of cute little sweaters and skirts and shoes. And um, also, if you've been out of work for a while and you need some clothes to go interview with, we have dry cleaners here in San Diego who have donated lots of clothes that people have dropped off and then just have forgotten to pick up. And I just kind of want to give a shout out to Ritz Cleaners in Oceanside and North Coast Cleaners at UTC. They donated a bunch of clothes and even the rack yesterday to kind of help people get back to work. Why'd you, why, why'd you do this? Well, you know, I just kind of felt like God just kind of put it on my heart. And I just happened to be watching the news one day and I saw a story about a clothing swap out in Michigan. And I thought, what a great idea. So I looked the lady up, I called her up. She told me how to do it. I organized it last year. It was a great success. We had about 200 people come out and uh, we gave them surveys and they said, please do it again next year. Yeah. So it's going to be this Sunday. Yep. And we're going to come back and talk about that. Actually, really quick, let's put up the board. It's this Sunday starting at 12 o'clock. 1230. 1230. Sorry. I'm 1230. She's moving back a little half hour so people can get through church and have a little lunch and goes until 330. 330. There you go. And the board's right up there. It's right here at the Tri-City Church, right in Vista. Very easy to get to off the 78 on Emerald Drive. Come on out. We're going to go through here. And you got to see also, Dan, where they've been storing some of the stuff because it's a lot of things coming in. But they're also saying if you want to drop off, maybe this week you have stuff, you can drop off at the school gym area and then they'll grab it and come clean and put it over here. But they do want clean clothes. Let's make sure they're clean clothes and they're wearable clothes. But of course, we all got stuff in our closets that we don't need. And this is one way you can start getting rid of them and then come in and grab stuff too. You got it. Yes, absolutely. Everybody's got stuff in their closet. I have like five bags, literally plastic bags full of clothes from my son that he's out and grown. They're, and this is a great place to bring them. It is. I, I'd say I'd give them to your son, but your son's already bigger than mine. I know. And he's only 12, so, you know. <laughs> That's the way it goes, you know. It is. It's he's, called genetics. He's wearing my clothes. He's yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me take that. I'm like, oh, so. I know. He's a big kid. Talented, too. All right. Hey, Brad, thank you.